Next item up. This is an item that I'm telling you. Just, <sighs> you're watching television. You're watching your favorite show. You don't wear earbuds or Bluetooth, but you're turning the sound up because you can't hear the dialogue. And the bass comes up and the car crashes go up, but you can't hear it. And when you do, everybody else in the, in the house goes, would you turn it down? It's so loud. What are you gonna do? This is called the TV sound box. It sold at the last two times it was on. We're in final quantities of the year. Sold at the last two times it was on. It is now here. It is a wireless television sound enhancing speaker. Part of it hooks up to your television. Just hooks right up to your television. The other part is absolutely wireless. Hook that up to your TV and then you take this wherever you want to go. Take it and put it by your favorite chair, by your couch. Here is the high-tech way that you use it. Maybe outside, like you have there. I love how the Rangers almost look like they're gonna go. Can we double box? Kiss. Oh, <laughs> so cute do. when they're facing each other. Um, and they'll light up for you every single night at the same time. So you've got that lovely display. And then every night, that timer is gonna light them up for no you. No delay. I know. It's, it's so no great, delay. And great I sound. Each one of these has that I can hear the voice. Power, the this is the difficulty the of it. There. Your mom, your dad, head, assisted living. And They're in a nursing home. They can't hear the dog on television. They want to watch game shows. They want to watch QVC and listen to the whatever the host is saying. Great, great product. Anywhere they go. And hooks up to literally any kind of television. Here comes Melissa Dawson. Melissa, I, I love having you here, but I just did the demo. I mean, that's, that's it. <laughs> That's it. That's it. You know, it's so funny, Rick, when this company called me and talked about this product, they were like, are you interested? I'm like, are you kidding? Like, I thought they built it just for me because, Rick, I am that annoying person when me and my husband are watching a movie. I'm like, what's the joke? What did he say? What happened? Like, I can never hear the dialogue. I'm always a little lost. And so this was such a godsend, not only for me, but really for my husband, because he can now get through an entire movie without Melissa asking 100 questions. But it really is so easy. I love it. There's no Wi-Fi. There's no Bluetooth. It physically plugs into the back of your TV. I'll show you how to do that in a second. And then you simply lift it off the base, and you can walk up to 100 feet away. So you can take this to your favorite chair, to the couch, to the kitchen, to the, maybe the bath, to your front porch to listen to the news, you now have your own Exposed personal speaker. Satellite. And I'll you actually turn mine up here. Your boots are, right? Instead of covering up like the <laughs> I only have it turned up about halfway. That's great. It's great. It's great. It's great. I, 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 I get it. That demo does it all. You know, my director, Pete, right now, you know what happens with him and his wife? He makes his wife turn on the subtitles. Oh, she tells you because she can't hear it. And you hate them. You hate the subtitles on there, but she can't hear because she's got to read the movie. I don't want to read the movie. I want to listen to the movie. This is a much better idea. So as people are shopping right now, sold out a couple times, uh, it's $22 to bring home and try on. Let's go to the hookup of the thing or the lack of hookup of the thing, Melissa. Let's get, make it as easy as you possibly can. <laughs> It is literally two minutes. It plugs into the wall because you're going to want to give it power. Okay. We include two different cables for you. We include an optical cable, which that optical cable just plugs right. You have an optical output in your newer flat screen TVs. Or if you have an older TV, this will work with any television. Right? That's fantastic. You have those red and white cables coming included as well. So two cables, plug it in. No passwords, no Wi-Fi, no Bluetooth. Uh, this is simple, you, easy, you, but it works. You know what I'm sensing? I'm sensing everybody should right now. You got a bedroom television, right? And it's not in your secondary television or another room, an office, whatever that is, right? It's an older TV. You don't want to invest in a brand new TV and, and blue, 150 people shopping right now and Bluetooth and headphones. And, about, yeah, and you just take the old, look at this. Look at, remember these? Remember these? That's what goes in. Every TV has these. They all have them. So an older TV has the red and the white, and then it wirelessly sends the signal, right, to this guy right here, and... I talked to Amy about it a little while ago, and I've been thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it, and I think I might have to do it. Okay, so... And Melissa, there's no delay. Right? right. From, from her voice... The, the cool part her, about this, Rick... I get a couple questions with this is, A, does this work independently of my volume TV? And the answer is yes. So everybody can be listening to the volume on their TV at a normal comfort level. But you have your own personal speaker. You can adjust as loud as you want to. So this works independently of your TV volume 
And let's say maybe you have a Bose surround sound speaker. I'll be honest, I actually tried a sound speaker before I, you know, was able to do this. And it didn't really help me because unfortunately, again, it was just, you know, louder sound in the room, but I still couldn't hear the dialogue. 200 people just shopping. It does everything. It's dialogue, it's sound, it's boom, it's action, it's whisper. And it just amplifies everything. But for me, this is Melissa's little speaker when I sit down on the couch that I just now hear every single thing. I love it. And trust me, my whole family is very thankful for it. I mean, there's 800 to go around, but just let, let's just talk about couples again for a second. Let's talk to Pete and his wife, me and my wife, and somebody can, you don't want to turn the subtitles, right? Like you just watch Dune with subtitles. Do you want to watch Dune with subtitles? No, but they, one person can hear you can't. And it's really frustrating. So you blare the thing, and now you're knocking the walls out, but the music so loud, so you can finally hear the dialogue and hear it. So you get this, right? For literally a few easy payments, and listen to the dialogue. You don't want it to be so big that it's like, you know, bending over on your ceiling. That's if real, not right now. House, That's that television. The or the flock. The flock is what we have here in the studio. It sounds great. Easy this is from my mic. This is happening in real time. How many and feet away can you be? Not that you're going to be like 300 you, feet away, but like the big across the room, You could right? go up to 100 feet away. So a lot of different uses that we use for this. Oh, oh I got know. one. I got one. What yeah. if like the TV's on in this room? I got an open, open um, floor plan and you go to the kitchen and you're making dinner. You can see the news, but you don't want to blare the TV. You could listen to... Lester Holt, right here, right? Absolutely. You know, I love reality TV. Um, my husband really doesn't. So I'll have the TV on with my favorite show. But yeah, I can be having kind of my own personal listening experience up to 100 feet away in the home. Um, porch, maybe you love to like sit on the porch and drink, you know, coffee in the morning, listen to your news. You could do that as well. You want to go in the bathtub, you know, and listen to your favorite music. You can do that. So lots of uses for this, so, Rick. So you could literally hear the Real Housewives breaking the wine glasses in another room while you're watching Real Housewives. Exactly. Uh, and so much and the other cool part, Please. too, Rick, is there's even a headphone jack right on the side. So let's say you wanted to use this in your bedroom, your partner's asleep. You can even plug in just a standard set of headphones, and now you've got your own, again, personal speaker. Or, But if you want to even be more private, there's even a little headphone jack on the side as well. Seven and a half hours of playtime, so it really does last you all day. When it's time to recharge, you simply just pop it back on the base at night time back on the base. to recharge. So, yep. hey, with a lot of people on the line, new TV, old TV, it's fewer than 700 remaining. Charge it, take it off, and here is the high-tech way to turn up the volume. There, there it is. It says volume. And then it gets louder. There's the volume. That's it. Amazing. Sold out various times it was on the air. Melissa, love the item. Love it. Thank you. We love it. Thank you so much. Okay, more to come in the show. Thank you, Melissa. That's called the TV Soundbox. We have it for you. By the way, Amy Strand's coming up. Amy Strand's just observing.